Philippines-US Enhanced Defense Cooperation Agreement takes our security cooperation to a higher level of engagement, reaffirms our country's commitment to mutual defense and security, and promotes regional peace and stability. Both President Obama and I share the conviction that territorial and maritime disputes in the Asia-Pacific region should be settled peacefully based on international law. We also discussed the Trans-Pacific Partnership, which is a high-standard trade agreement that will shape the global and regional economic architecture in the 21st century. The Philippines is working to ascertain how participation in TPP can be realized. The signing of the Comprehensive Agreement on the Bangsamoro last March 27 brings a just and lasting peace within our reach, a peace that will serve as a strong foundation for stability, inclusivity, and progress in Mindanao. Today I'm pleased that we're beginning an important new chapter in the relationship between our countries, and it starts with our security, with the new Defense Cooperation Agreement that was signed today. I want to be very clear. The United States is not trying to reclaim old bases or build new bases. At the invitation of the Philippines, American service members will rotate through Filipino facilities. Uh, today, we have reaffirmed the importance of resolving territorial disputes in the region peacefully, without intimidation or coercion. And in that spirit, I told him that the United States supports his decision to pursue international arbitration concerning territorial disputes 